Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at Windows 11 on the OnePlus 6T using Project Renegade. Project Renegade is a community-driven project that allows you to install Windows 11 on a variety of Android devices, including the OnePlus 6 and 6T. What is Project Renegade? Project Renegade is a community-driven project that allows you to install Windows 11 on a variety of Android devices, including the OnePlus 6 and 6T. The project is still under development, but it has come a long way in recent months. Why install Windows 11 on an Android device? There are a few reasons why you might want to install Windows 11 on an Android device. First, it can give you access to a wider range of software. Many Windows applications are not available on Android. So installing Windows 11 can give you the ability to run them on your Android device. Second is Windows 11 can give you a more desktop-like experience on your Android device. It has full functional Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and you can use SIM on Windows 11, but there is a catch to use SIM. You can only use one SIM on Windows. If you're used to working on a desktop computer, you may find that Windows 11 is more comfortable to use on your Android device than the stock Android operating system. What are the limitations of Project Renegade? It's important to note that Project Renegade is still under development. This means that there are some limitations to what you can do with Windows 11 on an Android device. For example, you may not be able to use all of the features of Windows 11, and there may be some bugs and glitches. How to use Windows 11 on an Android device? To use Windows 11 on an Android device, you'll need to install Project Renegade. You can do this by following the instructions on the Project Renegade website. Once you have installed Project Renegade, you'll need to download a Windows 11 ISO file. You can download this file from the UUP Dump website. I have already made a video on how to install this Project Renegade Windows 11 on OnePlus 6 and 6T. I will give the link of the video in the i button and also in the description so please do check it out. Once you have installed Windows 11 on your Android device, you'll be able to use it just like you would on a desktop computer. You can install Windows applications, browse the web, and work on documents. However, there are a few things to keep in mind when using Windows 11 on an Android device. First, you may need to install additional drivers for some of your hardware. You can find these drivers on the Project Renegade website. Second, you may find that some Windows applications don't work properly on your Android device. This is because these applications may not be designed for mobile devices, as this is the ARM version of the Windows 11. So only ARM-based applications will work on this project, Renegade devices. It's also important to note that Windows 11 on an Android device is not as powerful as Windows 11 on a desktop computer. This is because Android devices are not designed to run Windows 11. You can play PC games on it but will lag a lot. If you can even play GTA 5 but it will play at 10 to 15 FPS only. If you're planning on using Windows 11 on your Android device for gaming, you may be disappointed. Many Windows games are not designed for mobile devices, and those that do work may not run at full performance. If you're looking for a more desktop-like experience on your Android device, you may want to consider using a different operating system such as Linux. Linux is a more mature operating system than Windows 11, and it is designed to run on a variety of devices, including Android devices. Some hardware features also won't work in Project Renegade Windows. 11 devices such as phone, speakers, camera, fingerprint sensor. Overall, 
Project Renegade is a great way to install Windows 11 on a variety of Android devices, including the OnePlus 6 and 6T. However, it's important to note that the project is still under development, so there are some limitations to what you can do with Windows 11 on an Android device. So this is it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.